Hi, this is Mike Schmitz, and welcome to another edition of Screencasts Online. This week, we'll be taking a look at Fairlight Recording Studio for iOS by Wooji Juice. Fairlight is a multi track audio editor that is designed for journalists and podcasters from the ground up instead of musicians, giving you the tools, effects, and automation that makes publishing finished spoken audio projects a breeze. While it's still very difficult to record a podcast on an iPad, the touch interface combined with the simple design of Ferrite Recording Studio makes the iPad a great environment for editing and publishing. We'll cover some basic editing techniques and look at the built-in tools and effects that make Ferrite such a great option for broadcasters and podcasters. We'll show you how to set up automation like fading out an intro track, adding artwork and chapter markers to your final export, and leveling the audio in your final mix so that nothing is too soft or too loud. Let's get started. Let's start by downloading Ferrite Recording Studio from the App Store by launching the App Store application and searching for Ferrite. This top option is going to take us exactly where we want to go. The application that we're looking for is the first one listed here, Ferrite Recording Studio in the upper left. So let's tap on this to go to the listing for this application. And because I purchased this application previously, I can just tap to download it. Once this is done downloading, we'll tap the open button to open the application on our iPad. And we see a welcome screen, which is going to explain to us what's different here with version two compared to the original version one. The pricing structure changed between versions one and version two. And because I purchased the application previously when I launched this, the pro in-app purchase is going to be enabled for me by default. The pro in-app purchase for version two is not cheap. It's about 30 US dollars but it gives you many additional tools like the ability to prepare your audio for production with noise reduction and auto leveling, which we'll look at in a little bit. You also have the ability to add professional effects to your tracks, such as EQ, noise gate, or even dynamic range compression for projects that are gonna sound super clean. You can automate the volume panning and the effects settings so that they vary over time, both on individual tracks and in the final mix using the automations. You can tighten audio automatically to take out awkward pauses or gaps. You can create templates so you don't need to start from scratch every time that you want to create a new podcast episode, for example. You can use presets, and there's the ability to use audio unit extensions if you have other apps installed on your iOS device that provide other effects. Those will show up in Ferrite as well, and you can add them to your tracks and projects. So you get quite a bit with the in-app purchase, and when you compare it to the cost of something like Logic Pro 10, it's a bargain even at 30 US dollars. So let's dismiss this pop-up screen by tapping the Skip It button and get into the application itself. That's just a quick preview of one of this week's Apple-related tutorials from Screencasts Online. Screencasts Online is your premium source of Apple-related video tutorials. All of our members get access to brand new, up-to-date tutorials each week, as well as unlimited access to our entire video archive full of Mac and iOS-related tutorials. You can stream and download all of our videos on your Mac, iPad and iPhone and even your Apple TV using the members-only Screencasts Online Apple TV app. Membership also includes a complimentary subscription to the Digital Screencasts Online monthly magazine, published each month and packed with videos, articles, reviews, as well as hints and tips covering all aspects of the Mac, iPad, iPhone, and all of the other fantastic Apple products. So, if you're ready to start getting the most out of your Apple devices, Visit ScreencastsOnline.com today and become a ScreencastsOnline member.